Hi, this is Mike Shackelford with The Wizard of Odds at the 2019 Cutting Edge Table Game Show at the Paris Casino in Las Vegas. And I'm here with Paul Omohandro representing the game Short Deck Vegas 6 Plus Hold'em. So, Paul, thanks for having me, and can you tell me more about it? Certainly, thank you. Uh, Short Deck Vegas 6 Plus Hold'em uh, was uh, inspired by the latest craze in poker. So if you Google short deck poker or six plus poker, you're gonna see all the poker greats talking about why this is uh, refreshing the game of poker. So coming back into the live table game uh, market and trying to think of new games, certainly uh, decided that this was needed in the market. So we created a, the six plus hold'em version. I'm also creating a three card, four card, and five card stud version of short deck six plus hold. So I, this game looks to me rather similar to Texas Hold'em Bonus. Can you tell me about the similarities and differences? Absolutely. So I led the creation of Texas Hold'em Bonus back in my MyCon gaming days, and certainly it was an inspiration as I designed this out. Uh, has a whole card bonus based on the player's two whole cards. Also has a five card hand, best hand bonus as well. All right. So it looks to me like the game is basically the same thing as Texas Hold'em Bonus, except with the short deck and different side bets. Is that accurate? That would be accurate, yes. All right, so do you mind if I play a few hands to uh, show the audience uh, the game? Absolutely. All right, thank you. Place your bets. In Vegas 6 Plus Hold'em, you place a bet on the anti-wager, as well as the optional side bets, the 6 Plus Bonus, and the whole card bonus. The shuffle and the deal is very similar, if not identical, to what you would find in a poker room. Each player and the dealer get two cards each, and the player makes a decision on whether to fold or stay in the game by betting two times the anti-wager on the flop. The dealer burns a card and does the three card flop. At this stage, the player is in the game. He can either check the turn bet or bet it. If he bets it, it's equal the anti-wager. Burn another card and the turn card comes up. Again, the player has a choice to either check or bet the river. If he bets it, it's equal the anti-wager again. Player checks. Burn a card and the river. The dealer locks up the rest of the deck, exposes their two cards, and sets their best five card hand. Kings and queens with a 10 kicker. The board plays. Dealer checks the whole card bonus first. It doesn't have a pair or an ace and a face card, so that bet is locked up. He then addresses the six plus bonus bet, which requires three of a kind or better. Locks that up. Now he addresses the base game heads up against the dealer. Dealer plays the board. Player out kicks him with the ace. Queens and kings with an ace kicker. All bets pay even money on the flop, turn, and river. The anti-wager pushes up to three tens or better. Place your bets. The player places a wager on the anti-wager and the optional side bet, six plus bonus and whole card bonus. The dealer deals the game just like he deals in a poker room, two cards to each player, including the dealer. At this stage of the game, the player can either fold or stay in the game by doubling his anti-wager on the flop. The dealer burns a card and does the three card flop. Now the player has the option to check or bet. If he bets, it's equal the anti-wager. Burn a card in turn. The player has the option again to check or bet on the river. Again, if he bets it, it's equal the anti-wager. Dealer burns the last card, exposes the river card, locks up the deck, and then sets his best five card hand. Dealer has a pair of sixes and the king, uh, and a pair of tens with a king kicker. Tens and sixes with the king kicker. Dealer addresses the whole card bonus first. If he has a pair or an ace of face, he wins. He has a pair of queens. Any pair plays two to one. The dealer stacks up and sets it off to open up the payoff for the six plus bonus hand. Six plus bonus requires three of a kind or better. So we lock that bet up and now we address five, five card hand heads up. Player has queens and tens. 
with a king kicker that beats the dealer's tens and sixes, player wins. All winning wagers pay even money on the flop, turn, and river. The anti-wager is a push up to three tens or better. Well, thanks, Paul, so much for showing me the game. If I may ask you um, some questions, what can you tell me about the odds of the game? Well, certainly on the on the base game overall, because you're able to check and bet the turn in the river bets, so there is a lot of math that you would know that kind of creates what the overall is. But the, so on the base game itself, it's right around 5.6 percent, and then the side bets I shoot for a 10 to 12 percent range hold. Okay, so with the 5.6 percent, is that relative to um, just the anti bet? Yes. Okay, and um, so I recall in Texas Hold'em bonus, the I just know the first strategy decision point is to fold with 2-3 offsuit to 2-7 offsuit. Um, can you tell me anything about the strategy to this game? Yes, it's it's. there's only one hand mathematically uh, per our math that you should fold on, and that is the 6-7 offsuit. All right, and I take it after that the strategy probably gets kind of complicated. Exactly. All right. Well, Paul, thank you so much for having me. And this was Short Deck Vegas 6 Plus Hold'em. Thanks. Bye, YouTube.